I know you gonna dig this. Get, get, fu- get funky with me. I do today so here I am at Vasquez Rocks up in the mountains just past Los Angeles for another daily video I was, thought it was gonna be in Hollywood thought it was gonna be on Sunset Boulevard but instead this galoot drive me out to Vasquez Rocks no, I didn't drive and he, he drove I just galoot okay this galoot drove this galoot had the idea galoot? I can say whatever the fuck I want on my channel <laughs> <laughs> so yeah I can say galoot and wombat Wombat. <laughs> so Adam, Rain, and I are gonna take. A, we're, what are we doing today, Adam? You're 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 I think in charge. Shoot some deserty stuff. Who knows? Okay, so we're gonna fi- see what we find. This is amazing up here. <laughs> Movie. <laughs> Clueless. <laughs> Clueless. We are going to go through a, film, a few filming locations here, but then we're going to find some movie calling, ranches. I thought you were calling my chest a movie. <laughs> <laughs> what movie is this from? <laughs> bow, chicka, bow, wow. <laughs> what? Why does every one of your intros go off the rails? I don't know, but why is Rain you're like behind my mohawk? Thumbnail. You know, can see you. There it is. There's the thumbnail. All right, let's go. So if you look here, there's a little sign. Oh, it's a national park. It's not just a park. It's a park. No fire building, no rock collecting, no wood gathering. So, no wood for me. Ahem! Look at that. How incredible is that? The whole video could just be shot here and just to show you the beauty of this place. There's that pink uh, Winnebago motorhome, Winnebago, and he's got a pink tent of some sort. That's weird. Yeah, let's get, let's, if we can hike up there, that'd be cool. Real Barbie RV. We've got the story behind the pink this is RV. Real Barbie RV. Owned by this gentleman right here. Real Set, Barbie setting Barbie. up for a photo shoot, and that's the real Barbie. Yeah. That's the RV. RV. Yeah. Real Barbie RV. Real Barbie RV. Yeah. Real Barbie RV. Pretty cool. Well, just, I don't know what voice that was. Real Barbie RV. Voice? What? Was that a Flintstone voice? That was a Hanna Barbera voice. Yeah. Exit. Stage left. That's close to something. Take a look up there. We're not going to do the whole walk up through these rocks, but Blazing Saddles, uh, Bill and Ted's Bogus Journey, Star Trek, Alpha Dog. I've done videos for you before. I'll, put a, I'll find a link to that below the Vasquez Rocks one. Alpha Dog was a great movie and it was filmed down the other side. And the Flintstones set was built right down here. How crazy is that? Scott Adapt! Take a look at that cool house way up in the hills. Just up on the mountaintop there. Yeah. Oh. Hey, oh, so we're not going all the way up to the rocks. I was just saying, we got the pink Barbie RV. The real, pink, real Barbie RV. Well, they're insane. Let's say, let's say that we're them. Yeah. <laughs> Throw your camera to them and have them film for you. It's a, it, it, looks, it looks like it's, it's like, very, very steep. It's very steep yep. and, and, it's, and we're lazy. It's hot. Yeah. Yeah. We're only in our 30s, but we're we're tired. We just started the day, yeah, as yeah. far as they know. Yeah, this is really this is 6 a.m. Take a look there. There's a rock in a rock. I don't know if rocks grow. I'm not sure how that works, but it's science. But that's a rock growing out of a rock. Huh. It's hot. Milk was a bad choice. Yeah, Ray, you're a southern boy. What's going on? You're you're red as a lobster. Like you 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 live in the sun. I went from normal to skin cancer in one day. <laughs> We're leaving Vasquez Rocks. There they are behind us. We're going to another location, somewhere up in the desert, Santa Clarita area, above Los Angeles. Los Angeles. You'll be back. 
in tomorrow's video. Look out, Gage! So, look at this little grocery store in the middle of nowhere. Real groceries. Groceries? Groceries. Devil's Rejects, right there. One of my favorite horror films, Rob Zombie, Devil's Rejects, just film right here. But Last Starfighter was all done here. The trailer park was behind. They built it all here. This is it. This is the set pretty much of Last Starfighter. It was all done here. And you look over here. It's an old uh, mini tractor. See out into this valley here. California is endlessly beautiful. Endlessly beautiful. Trail Park was built right down there. And the famous staircase from Last Starfighter is behind the building. And the people live there. So they don't really let people go down behind. It's gated off, as you can see. But yeah. I'm more excited about Devil's Rejects right here. Alright, we're going somewhere else. Up in the desert. Desert area. I don't consider this really the desert yet. It's not the desert. I shouldn't have said that. Desert's further north. But, um... It's hot. It's like a desert. I've got sand in my shoes. It's, it's deserty. Mr. The Woo. So explain to me again, just to quickly, about Last Starfighter, what was set up here in the parking lot. So the end, the end scene where the, the starship comes back right. to the gas station, the grocery store. Well, not a gas station, a grocery store. And the trailer park was down the hill. Yeah. From what I could tell, it was not on a sound stage. It looks like it was all right here in this parking lot. They built a spaceship in this parking lot right here in this dirt. And what about the arcade game? You said it was on a cement slab. It's all, so basically, at the far end of that building, they built like a little barn door. That's a fake barn door. So there's, behind that is just nothing. But they built that so some people couldn't walk over there and try to get the angle from the last Starfighter. So that was built for the movie or that was built after? That was built after to block people from going over there and looking at it. So the video game would have been down that way a bit? Yep down that way but but that's where the uh the end shot was right here right where the same end shot of devil's rejects not same end shot not same end same, shot. same shot as yeah, devil's rejects yeah the Rejects. beginning you want to do the quote let's do the do the clown quote what does he say you know you've been seeing it all day don't you like clowns aren't you bleeping funny <laughs> aren't they bleeping funny i, I screwed it up something <laughs> like that close I'm, enough i'm paraphrasing sid and of course this is my channel so we'll say Aren't we fucking funny? Aren't we fucking funny? I can swear. Demonetize. <laughs> the woo doesn't swear. No. Don't demonize my demonetize. Aren't we fucking funny? So we're walking through a parking lot in Placerita Canyon, correct? Yes. Placerita Canyon to the Oak, Oak of the, the Golden Shower. What's it called? Oak of the Golden Dream. Oak of the Golden Dream. And what happened here? This is where gold was first found in California. I'm Crazy. reading about it right now. Back in 1842, before California's Great Gold Rush. My goodness. So this is a historical spot. Yeah, there's, a, there's an arrow, Oak of the Golden Dream, right there. Or is this it right here? No, it's, far, it's, it's a little bit of a hike down in here. Oh boy. Not too far. Could have told me that like before. Maybe, maybe three miles. Nah, maybe two. Two miles. I shouldn't have worn my bedroom slippers, but okay. And the first thing, before we get over here, we're going to have a seance. This oh, nice. A seance. There's a whole seating area over here. Area over here. Oh, there's Uranus. There's Earth. <laughs> yeah, you can't not. Come on. Out of all the planets, you got to show that. you got to say that. <laughs> yeah. This is it, folks. I don't dance. It's the bad joke, so not. Yes. Water done dried up. How's that tan coming along? Uh, I'm at a level <laughs> ten and a half of fire. You, you, you look like uh, the Dave Grohl in Tenacious D. <laughs> Tenacious I'm, I'm, D movie. I'm gonna have to color correct my photos. So <laughs> yeah. I don't look like the devil. Now let's see if the water was working here because water out here, I'm assuming, is off. Oh wow. Mm. Look at this tiny of this fox here. It's got a little meal in its it is a little in its jowls. Wombat. I remember yesterday we saw all those squirrels on the PCH. There's one of them now, made it all the way over here. There's a deer watching because deers hunt like that. 
<laughs> I'm butterfly. Very nice. And I know you guys are probably wondering why the heck are you dragging us down here through this kind of this creepy alley where Pennywise should be kind of camped out? <laughs> As you guys right over here is the Oak of the Golden Dream. There it is. Where gold was first discovered and started the gold rush here in California. Right here, the Oak of the Golden Dream. And there's a little more information on here, so I'm not making this up. No, we'll let you read it. Let me zoom in on this a little bit more. Shall I read? You ready? Francisco Lopez made California's first authenticated gold discovery on March 9th, 1842. While gathering wild onions near an oak tree in Placerita Canyon, he found gold particles clinging to the roots of the bulbs. Right here. The bulbs. So he was taking a little snooze fest near some onion plants. I see. Where does it say? Where does it say he was taking a snooze fest? I mean, that's what I would do. So I'm just thinking. <laughs> yeah, you're making this guy sound so lazy. Well, no. He's I, out gathering onions, and you're calling him a lazy about. Because <laughs> the guy. I always. I just assumed he was. You taking, put respect on Mr. Lopez's name. I just thought he was sleeping under the. No, onion he's plant. collecting wild onions, I mean, as he, you do. What kind of dreams would you have if you, if you smelt onions while you were <laughs> I can't, I don't know. He discovered gold for guys. Yeah. So yeah, this is place. Yeah, six years before the other uh, gold was found somewhere else. I wonder if the guy got rich, Mr. Lopez. So we were just reading this sign here and apparently Mr. Lopez was napping and then he was dreaming that he was surrounded by gold and it was very rich and upon awakening he picked a bunch of wild onions that were growing around some sycamore trees just north of the great oak tree oh and attached to the onion roots were several small pieces of gold the first re the recorded discovery of gold in california so there's gold inside there but actually Doing a little digging here on the Google plaque, yeah. it was sycamore trees behind this tree. This okay. tree marks the spot of where the sycamore trees were behind it. So the gold was discovered so not from the bulbs of this, okay. the bulbs of the sycamore. Should we recreate the map and go lay over there in the foliage? Yeah, I'm done. Oh, yeah. wow. Wreckage. Wow. the side of the hill. Look at that. Well, so you can see the tire tracks here. Yeah. Looks like he was drinking, obviously. Columba. He was drinking out of this silver flat. Was the tin man here? Oh, why am I just... <laughs> Look at that. It's a motorcycle, is it? No? No, it's a fender. Wow. I'm rocket man. Yeah, I was just about to put it on. <laughs> Let's see. Rocket your actual face is Your actual face is redder than that, oh, I which is that. crazy. I you got some sun to that, or yesterday to that. Plenty. Of sun. Is this your st it looks like you're stain on the surface of the well, sun? I, well, this is where you checked in. <laughs> I, do, I do completely normal to melanoma in one day, like nobody's business. Look, tell me the story, Scott. What happened with this shoe right here? This shoe? Well, oh, a couple of surfer boys came out here experimenting for the first time. You know, first love, summer camp. There was some boys camp right up the street. And the one kid had a foot fetish. The other kid said, what? What's the what's the fetish? And well, it went from there. Makes sense that it'd be in the state. Yeah, makes sense, yeah. It's hot out here. <laughs> this is it. Gold discovered for the first time here. None left. We've looked. A couple of old caps. Well, some plastic caps, pylons. That's about it. Water comes off here. It's supposed to spill into here. This looks like a... A 1982 water park theme park leftover yeah. tubing raft off of here. How many accidents have happened in this road? And look, there's even a sign up there saying, you know what? Be careful. Oh, look. yeah, right up there. But people aren't paying attention. The counselors weren't paying any attention. If you watch your ass channel, you're going to go into a little bit more depth about this. The Walker Cabin, just right near the Oak of the Gold. What's it called? The Oak of the Golden Dream. This is owned by a family in the 1920s. With a bunch of kids. How many kids? Twelve kids? And they started renting out the movie studios in the 1920s and they built the crews, built this, this, this. Let's see what we can see inside. Oh my god. There's a cow inside. 
And a typewriter. Is there? Yeah. What's going on? Hey, mister. Hey, mister. What are you doing in there, cow? Get out of there. Cow in there? Yeah. It's ridiculous. Cows don't live in houses. You see the cow? Yeah. Hey, right home. Right there. From a butterfly garden near that little uh, Walker house, near Oak of the Golden Dream, we're going now to the Disney Ranch to see what we can see from the side of the road, right? Named Golden Oak Ranch. That's it. Lots of things have been filmed there, and we're going to show you some stuff from a view that is going to blow your mind or bore you to death. Stay tuned. Is the barn still there? I don't know. I've never seen it with my own eyes, but it's somewhere on this property. But this is right here. This is part of Golden Oak Ranch Disney Stu Disney Studios up in um, the canyons here above Los Angeles. And you can see down there, there's a fence. So even if you want to get over there, that's a pretty, pretty nifty security fence. And there's another fence here. So two fences, but they've shot so many things here. We were saying A-Team. Uh, Beverly there's not 2 and 0, but this looks fairly new as Adam was saying before, but you see this back lot here, but it stretches all the way around here, all the way down, all the way, and they've shot Back to the Future, what was the other couple of movies we were seeing? I was just looking up again, Big Top Pee Wee was here. Big Top Pee Wee, wow. Cat from Outer Space. Loved it. Apple Dumpling Gang. Yep. Don Knotts, Gus, the Don, Don Knotts, Knotts yeah. the, the donkey. Yeah, one of the donkeys still here. Donkeys live forever, so maybe. Oh, that's a nice thought. I think I made Universal might have bought them out though. <laughs> bought the donkey? Yeah, yeah, bought them out, yeah. <sighs> I bought, really bought the donkey on that one. <laughs> that's a new scene. <laughs> we just bought the donkey. <laughs> All donkeys live forever. New movie, write it down. That's what we're filming. That's a movie, we're, we're making a movie together, the three of us, we've decided. All donkeys live forever. Love this it. is another view, look at that. So like I said, there's, it's just stretches on and on this, this ranch. This is a private Disney-owned ranch, but so many things are filmed here. And we're getting to see it. You're seeing it with me, with your own eyes, right here. Hey, mister. Who goes sneaking around on Golden Oak Ranch? This says private property right here. But another fun fact, this is where Marty leaves the Peabody Valley. Pulls up here and turns the corner Original Back to the Future location right here. Marty leaves the uh, he leaves the DeLorean in the in the barn, right? Right. And he comes up here. And this would not make Biff happy. I drove all the way to your house, and all you have for me is a light beer. <laughs> this is just uh, this is just up the road, right around the corner. Is that uh, where those facades are? This is leading down to the Peabody barn from Back to the Future. Now, I don't know, I can't remember the movie. Does he, he hides the DeLorean in the barn, but he, or he gets the DeLorean. He wrecks it in the barn. He, pardon? He wrecks it into the barn. Wrecks it in the barn and then drives it back he out. first goes in the past, he wrecks it in the barn, drives across the field, is in the parking lot of Twin Pines Mall, goes back in time, puts the scarecrow, goes into Peabody's farm, farm, the whole family comes out, Paul tries to, you know, pulls a gun out, take that, you space, you know what. Right. Fires at the barn door, and then Marty drives the it drives out this way. Drives out, busts through the Peabody barn, and then comes out through here. And I explained the scene completely wrong. There it is, completely right. And he drives down this way. Is that the theme? Now we go back in time, and be careful of the man with the balloon. Never, never stop for the man with the balloon. Don't stop. Don't stop. Don't stop. Hmm. And here we are on a little road called the Old Road, which is one of my favorite roads uh, in the Los Angeles area. It stretches down along the 5 freeway, but all the way down and around, up and around. It's just a really beautiful drive. I was about to say on a summer day, but every day is kind of a summer day out here. But this right here. If you're a Halloween fan, this is from Halloween 3, Season of the Witch, the, the, uh, from the very beginning of the movie, but also the very ending. Right in there. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Yelling right in there. 
and look at this. I mean, it looks like it's made of, um, I don't know what the hell it looks like it's made of. It's just weird. Wow. Well, pretty cool. That, thank you, sir. The gentleman just brought us some pictures of I what the gas station more. used to look like. So you, this, you, this is the gas station right there? It is right there. That's it? Mm -hmm. yeah. This is the house where I live right there in the front. Oh, wow. So you own this gas station? Uh, before, my boss owned it. I, I, I work for my boss and I live in the house. Nice. The house is a restaurant before. Oh, is it a restaurant? There. Yeah. Very cool. I got more pictures. Many old. All right, guys, where are we? In a very windy area. Yeah. In a cavernous, windy area. On the old the road. old road, but it continues far. They built the Storage King USA. Road. They built the new road next to it. Right. It's, you want to get on the old road, not the new road. Turn left where the old red barn used to be. And then where Mr. Jameson's mule passed away. I'm not from here, sir. Gus the donkey. Please. Can I just look type it in my GPS? <laughs> nope. Go up there where old man Clemens spit back in 1942. <laughs> Is this a movie or is this just making it up? Just making it That's up. pretty good improv. UCB, UCB, My upright home. comment, upright citizens, huh? UCB, second city, huh? I'm in charge of sun. Yeah, apparently. The UCB was a shout out to my buddy Fred Armisen. UCB, Bobby Moynihan, SNL. That's oh, a good backdrop. Yeah, that's beautiful. Look at that. So we just saw the video here. Another video coming tomorrow. We're gonna keep plugging, chugging, plugging, chugging. You do it daily. I don't know what the hell. Daily for five days. Then, 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 then no, that's no, no. it. The Leave back in the three. comment section if you want to go longer than five days. No, don't. Because <laughs> I know how you love the comment section. I can't go longer than five minutes. Hey, -o! hey. No. You are correct. Ha, 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 ha. Hey, oh. All right. Peace. See you tomorrow.